Shannon Depking said that Syracuse needed more offense, and boy, did they get it today. A 10-0 win in game one of a three-game series over the Pittsburgh Panthers. And it was early and often in this one, Faith. Leilani Mayfield with a single through the left side to open up the scoring for the Cuse. And Coach Depking said that Mayfield was one of those players that needs to step up, especially since Tony Martin with the broken thumb is hurt. She was the leading RBI leader on this team. And then... You know, it seemed like everybody was stepping up. We had A.J. Kaiser coming in big already in the first inning. Big swing all the way over the fence using her power like she always has had. And then in the third inning, we had A.J. Kaiser again coming big through the middle. And the offense for the Syracuse Orange was just on fire all day. They never stopped. They left 21 runners on in the last three games, but in this game only left one runner on. And that was the difference in this game. They had key hits. They made big plays for Alexa Romero on the mound and they had pitching. And when you have all three of those components together, you are just great out there on the field. Four runs in the first, five in the third for Syracuse. And Alexa Romero, although not as dominant as usual, still did more than enough on the mound. She did great on the mound. She was a little wild compared to what she usually is, but she had four strikeouts on the day, used her curveball and rise ball. And you can see it was only a five-inning game, 10 to nothing for Syracuse over Pitt. The big stat there, though, the hit discrepancy, not all that much. Pitt still had six hits against Alexa Romero. Syracuse just took better advantage. Syracuse only left one runner on base. Pittsburgh left 11, and that was the difference. Syracuse, a dominant 10 0 win in game one of a three game series with Pitt. They'll try to do it again tomorrow on Saturday.